Hey guys, I just made a video on my um, uh, Paloma for Truth page, which I'm not using anymore. I unpublished it for, you know, they have a, they have a lot of stuff on there that I just unpublished for now. And so, for those of you who uh, don't follow my my Truth by Paloma page, it's uh, it's the one that I'm using now instead of my my Paloma for Truth. So, I was talking about something called Darvo, something that I've been learning about for the last two days. Uh, D-A-R-V-L, for those of you who want to look it up and see what that is. And you know, it's funny because I don't, re I didn't realize, um, I mean, a lot of this stuff, a lot of the tactics, a lot of the, um, the things that I've, that I've actually dealt with over the last uh, couple years are, um, are documented and they're so well documented and I had no idea. And, uh, and it, I think this is just a, a constant, uh, learning journey for me. But I learned about this Darvo thing today, which was really, really interesting to me. Um, so, anyway, I'm not using my uh, my my Paloma for Truth page anymore, and I'm using the Truth by Paloma page. So, for those of you who want to follow that one, super tired, so I'm uh, probably gonna just check out, go watch a movie for the night, and. Um, and just take the night off. I mean, it's early. It's 9:29, but here in the in the West Coast, anyway. I got a long day tomorrow, so anyway, um, learn about that for those of you who are interested. Darvo, hi Adolfo, how are you? I learned about something uh, today that I feel, especially in the beginning, was uh, really used uh, as a tactic by some of the people that that uh, that started attacking me in the very beginning. Uh, people like Amy, I think, is one of the ones that used this type of tactic. Darvo, look it up, Adolfo. Um, you know that I experience a lot. And through that experience, I also learn a lot. So I learned about something called Darvo. Look it up, okay? It'll remind you of things that we've seen in the past, um, things that people will have used with me. And that for some reason, I'm just learning about now, you know? Um, so, yeah. Anyway, this page is really small. And I unpublished the uh, Paloma for Truth one, as you know. I'm just using the uh, Truth by Paloma. And that, uh, because now you know they're watching every single thing that I do, uh, which is kind of flattering. At, and at the same time, it's, uh, it's motivating. It's motivating because I mean, I know that I've been very distracted with all kinds of things, and I know that, you know, that was the main uh, purpose of uh, a lot of things that these people did, obviously, to distract me, right? Um, but it's also good to know that even throughout those distractions, even through those distractions, I'm still here, um, and I've been able to actually move on and accomplish things, and uh, especially things that seem complicated and that they are, they're actually complicated, um, but I've actually accomplished them by, by learning to balance my time between the attacks, which is a negative, and, uh, and the positive, right? Uh, you know me, I always keep going, Adolfo, so, and uh, especially with the help of so many of our great, you know, our great um, collaborators, associates, whatever we wanna call them, right? <laughs> Uh, I've been able to move on and uh, and keep on going, you know, in spite of all the obstacles, um, all the things uh, thrown at me. But but again, I learned about this Darvo thing today, and uh, I'm fascinated by psychology. I really am, and the reason why is because I obviously feel that human behavior is key to understanding human behavior and, uh, and understanding our interaction among humans, between humans, is the key to everything that we do in life. Communication, right? Um, and this is one of the tactics that is used a lot and it, it actually has a psychological 
um, a psychological understanding, like, like a psych, like a psychological documentation behind it. That I, again, I'm I'm new to this. If I would have known about this maybe two years ago, um, maybe I would have uh, handled things different. So it's a constant learning process, especially being in the public eye, especially dealing with public attacks, especially uh, de uh, dealing with uh, smear campaigns, especially dealing with. Um, with people who we think we know and that we may not know, you know? Um, I, uh, I'm so thankful and I'm so glad for the small group that, that and it's actually not even that small, but for the group that, uh, that I've created with some people, um, that even though we don't interact so much publicly, um, I know that I have, you know, some, some I've met and some I, I actually haven't, you know? Um, but, but yet, you know, it's, uh, it's very uh, comforting to know that, that, uh, that these people are, are there, you know? It's, uh, it's, it's a big, big, uh, big tool, big um, system of support and uh, to have that, you know? So anyway, thank you to those of you because I know that you're, you're, you're gonna be watching whether you're watching now or whether you're watching later. Uh, I know you're watching because you, I know that, that you truly do care and that you're very supportive of everything that I do. And I really appreciate that from you guys. Um, but anyway, my Truth by Paloma is unpublished, as you probably noticed by now. And now I'm, I'm using the uh, Paloma for Truth page and uh, some of my other uh, political pages that I haven't been using as much as I, as I did before. Uh, and some, of are, some are unpublished, but some are still there. So... Anyway, just want to say hi. Um, hope you guys are having a good weekend. And, um, and learn about this. There's nothing better in life than continuing to learn, uh, either for yourself or to help others, um, or to help yourself, or to help yourself heal from any trauma, any, um, any, any, any problem that you may have, you know? Learning is, is key. And also to better your relationships with other people, you know, which in turn means a better quality of life. The better relationships that you have with people, with those around you, whether it is uh, your friends, your family, your whatever it may be, you know, friendships, relationships, partners, um, family, the better relationships you have. Um, the better your quality of life will be. We're humans, we need human interaction, and it's not just physical interaction, it's actual emotional, psychological interaction. Um, and uh, and I, I think that a healthy, um, a healthy social, emotional, psychological life is uh, the key to happiness. You know, there's so much more. There are couples that have been married for, you know, 30, 40, 50 years. I think you, uh, I think maybe we've talked about that before, Adolfo. And that, um, and imagine if they just based everything on, um, you know, certain things. It's, it's, it's a comprehensive, uh, comprehensive approach. I mean, there's so much, right? There's so much. And, um, and I think that's the key to fulfillment, to happiness, to real, real, uh, lasting joy. We have so many divorces. We have, I mean, the divorce rate is through the roof. Um, probably more now than it had, that never ever had that it ever has been. You know, recently with the pandemic, a lot of people, a lot of people got divorced or broke up or separated during the pandemic, and some people became closer than ever because what really happened with the pandemic is that people really got to know each other like they had never gotten to know each other before. So that can either make you or break you. When you really get to know someone, that can either make you or break you. It could bring you very close to that person or it can separate you forever. Um, but either way, either way, getting to know someone is the best way to really figure that out, right? So anyway, just wanted to share that. I'm gonna share that to my other, share this to my other page. And um, make sure you follow my uh, Paloma for Truth page, okay? Good night, everybody. I'm going to go watch a movie. I'm exhausted. Been out all day. Had so much to do. Took my my, um, 
My dog used to the vet. The vet was closed because I got there so late. They closed it too. So um, it was kind of a kind of a weird day because as much as I did in all the places where I went, I couldn't get all the things that I wanted done. But you know that's just how it goes sometimes. So anyway, good night everybody. Good night Adolfo. I'll see you later. I'll talk to you guys later. Okay, bye.